I'm John Owak, Director of Marketing here at VPX Sports, uh, here with Sean Roden, uh, who's decided to stop by the facilities today to see what VPX is all about. Um, we're following Sean on his road to the 50th Mr. Olympia. Being here today at the VPX corporate office, meeting the staff, uh, once again touring the product line, uh, meeting with Jack, um, going to have a training session and so forth. So it's been a very, it is and will be a very interesting day as well as uh, the Road to the Olympia series that we will be doing, showcasing the VPX product and how we incorporate it into my training for this year Olympia. All right, this way, Mr. Flexotron. This is it. This room right here is where all the shots are made. The two and a half and three ounce shots. You can see him running the grape now. A few hundred bottles a minute. They're boxed, packaged, taped, and shipped. Every great human achievement is preceded by extended periods of dedicated, concentrated effort. If you start coming down here a lot, we'll have to widen this, get you your own yeah, fucking spot. Right. After I win the Olympia, I can pick it up. So it's just sitting here right now in the office. You guys can see, that's my new ride. Just waiting for me to get that sand out and then uh, they have it shipped to me. Courtesy of DPF Sport. I get to. Uh, Electron all over the top, EPX uh, on the side. Get some nice rim, get nice wrap. And, uh, you think uh, 26 inch rims or 28s? 28. 28s? Oh, yeah. Hairnets required beyond this. For me, I get to wear a special beard net as well. And here is a lab, research and development, quality control and quality assurance. This is where a lot of the fun stuff happens. They're mixing up the new flavors, the new products. It all starts from here. They have the HPLC machines in here where they test the purity of the ingredients, make sure that they're up to snuff. They do uh, stability testings on new products to make sure that it is uh, shelf stable prior to hitting the market. Now that is our chemical hood. That one is a pretty neat machine. Um, allows you to make pretty much any any ingredient you want, the, uh, the processes of chemical reactions and whatnot. I had to get a lot of special permits to, to have that in here. Looks like they're making some synthesized grape in here. Filling it. Now that is our V blender. And that, that takes a bunch of the uh, the raw ingredients and mixes them up into uh, one single mixture. That way you get the even dispersion of all the ingredients. You're not getting one scoop of only one ingredient, you know? It's like the, the Flexitron of blending machines right there. there you, you know? So you at home with your Nutribullet, 
<laughs> we have our bee blender. <laughs> Smells like they might be making some bars. That machine right there uh, makes our Redline Ultra Hardcore. It puts two different micro tabs and the liquid inside of a capsule. It's uh, one of only two or three machines in the world that can do that, I believe. And here it looks like they're pre-blending all the ingredients for the uh, zero impact bars before they go on the line. Sounds like German chocolate. Yeah. Oh, it looks like they're running them. Lucky you. Yes. 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 This is where the magic happened, folks. Look at that. This Fresh is bars. it. Yeah. Fresh zero impact bars. Incredible. You might have to steal one off the line. Yeah. Hello. How you guys doing? Can we grab one of those to eat? Hey, we have one to eat? Yeah. All right. Over there, you can give us one of the ones that are no, no good. No? Just a label? Yeah. That's, that's fine. That's fine, bud. Yeah. We just want to eat them. Fresh off the line. Thank you. How's the smell? Looks pretty moist. Fresh off the line. Tastes like a German chocolate cake? This is how soft it is. Literally bending over. I thought we need to try it. That's good. Can I grab one for Yeah. I'm running the ultra hardcore right now. Putting the labels on. Going through the heat shrink. So as you can see, most of our products are done here in-house. Something that not many companies can claim. Pills, bars, powders. Um, we've actually opened up our facilities to uh, doing third-party manufacturing, so if other companies decide, you know, they'd like for us to produce some products for them, that is uh, an opportunity that we have explored. And uh, it's pretty cool. Um, our main shipping warehouse is actually next door to this. Uh, similar situation, products kind of from the floor to the ceiling. This is obviously the uh, RTD line. You can see them putting in the clear bottles right there. They get labeled a little further down. Go all the way down, get heat shrunk, then get the four pack wrapped right around there. 
and then they come out in a case configuration from that machine and are shrunk again. Bunch of clear bottles. That's where they get palletized and uh, shrunk wrap. You a fan of Breaking Bad? <laughs> Lemon drop. Lemon drop, yep. Power punch, champagne. I think uh, between all of our warehouses, we're somewhere around 200,000 square feet. This one is mainly just for the uh, raw materials, boxes, ingredients. I uh, definitely want to thank uh, my sponsors, the VP Export, uh, Weeder AMI, Flex Magazine, uh, She Export, Six Pack Bag. Uh, thank you guys for all your support. Um, it's going to be a fun, great year and I'm looking forward to the road ahead. Thank you Flex Magazine and Sean Roden for stopping by. It's always nice to have you guys here at VPX. Um, you saw what we're about. Uh, research, development, and science are at the forefront of everything we do here at VPX. We're very excited to be working with Sean, Chris Aceto, and Charles Glass as Sean continues his road to the 50th Mr. Olympia. <laughs> I'm not going to do that.